God's not forgotten about you. So we're going to sing one more song tonight. That's called Not Forgotten. Just as a message to let you know that Jesus is still here. That Jesus still loves you. Come on.
And I want you to get ready to come around the front because you're going to help us pray. Come on, ministry, make your way. I believe the Lord is going to heal some people tonight. You came in thinking it was a concert, but God's getting ready to heal your heart. God's getting ready to heal your mind. God's getting ready to heal your marriage. God's getting ready to heal your finances. All right. The miraculous is here in the building. But I'm going to tell you how the miracles are going to come. The miracles are not going to come from a person that just lays their hands on you and says this or that or whatever so and so. I tell you how the miracle is going to happen. It's going to come from somebody's heart that has faith and compassion. I'm about to tell you about something right here. The miracles that God worked in the Bible came from compassion for whoever he was getting ready to perform the miracle for. All right, do you believe that? There was blind people in the Bible. Jesus laid his hands on them or did something, and it was by compassion for that individual that the miracle was done. God didn't need faith. God just needed compassion. Just because it's not you standing up here in the front doesn't mean that the need is not real. Can I help the people in the back? It doesn't mean that the need is not real. So what's getting ready to happen? God's getting ready to do it in this house. There is so much power in this building you don't even understand. If you got the Holy Ghost, you got power to tread on serpents, to cast out devils. You got power. So we're getting ready to lift our voice. And I don't care how you respond here, but if you're ministry and you're up here getting ready to help us pray for these people, God's getting ready to lift the cloud off of your head tonight. God's getting ready to reverse the bad diagnosis tonight. God's getting ready to restore that calling in your life tonight. God's going to do it. So we're going to pray. And we're going to have a move of the Holy Ghost here in the house tonight. If you didn't come for a move, I'll see you later. But if you're ready to have a move of the Holy Ghost, it's going to happen tonight. Jesus, by the authority that is in your name, the power that is in your word, we curse every mind devil. You have no place here. You cannot stay here. We curse every lying spirit that would speak against your children. We curse every lying spirit that would speak against your chosen people. We declare apostolic ministry. We declare apostolic authority. We declare apostolic deliverance. And we declare it in Jesus' name. Come on, the gifts are flowing in the building. The gifts are operating in the building. Come on, if you feel to go pray for somebody, go pray for them. Operate in the Holy Ghost. That's it, sister. Operate. That's it, brother. Operate. Yeah, musicians, play in the Holy Ghost. Play in the Holy Ghost.
yes he can Oh yes he can That's it, get the victory on the side That's it, get the victory on the side That's it, get the victory That's it, get the victory ownership of your ailment you've taken ownership of the depression that's in your life because you say I'm depressed you've taken ownership of the anxiety in your life because you said I have anxiety but just because it's a diagnosis doesn't mean that we can't cast that thing out the generation that will stand up with your shoulders squared back and say devil you have no place here anxiety you have no place here depression you have no place here let's take dominion in the house we curse every devil that would speak and depress your people we curse every devil. We curse anxiety in Jesus' name. We curse depression in Jesus' name. You want to shout? Yeah, that's it. God is restoring your prayers. God is. Shout it, 
shout. That's God lifting depression off of you. That's God lifting anxiety off of you. I ain't afraid of no devil. I ain't afraid of no depression. I'm not afraid of no anxiety. I know who my king is. I know who my God is. You ought to speak the name of Jesus in the building until you feel the chains start falling. Oh yeah, come on, there's a deep current of the Holy Ghost flowing. I feel the heart of an intercessor in the building. You've stepped a little deeper tonight. Come on, operate a little deeper. Pray for your brother, pray for your sister, as if it was yourself. Yeah, sister, yeah, sister. Yeah, sister!